A UW student is in trouble tonight for posting anti-Semitic images on campus. The incident happened at Celery Hall on campus. News 3's Keely Arthur joins us live from the UW campus tonight. Keely? Eric, UW officials aren't calling this a hate crime, rather a prank gone wrong between floor mates. Today, though, as more students found out what happened, they say they're very disturbed. Like, this can't happen, you know? An anti-Semitic act on the minds of many as a Celery Hall dorm door was covered in printouts of Hitler and swastikas. The Jewish population is definitely here, so... You know, it's, it's, it's affecting that a lot. Striking a chord with students like freshman Peyton Gardepe, who lives in the same building. I was actually raised Jewish, so it's definitely, you know, hitting home for sure. The incident happened January 26th when another student who describes himself as agnostic Jewish came back to his dorm to find five swastikas and three pictures of Hitler stuck to his door. A student on the same floor eventually admitted to the act. It's a frightening thing. It's, it invokes, the images invoke um, really, you know, dehumanization, anti-Semitism, hate. UW disciplined the perpetrator and alerted some students, but the majority found out through social media in the past two days. It deeply right. hurts our community. <coughs> and that's why we're here, frankly, is because we stand for something better than that. And we want something better for that for our students, for our community. Gardepe admits he wishes he knew about the incident earlier, but is now hoping to end it on a positive note. It's just unacceptable, and I'd love to talk to him and, you know, inform them on whatever they don't know to help them understand it. And UW is wanting to continue the conversation. They're hosting a meeting here at Gordon Commons next Tuesday for staff and students to come together.